In America, we have some professional standards across almost every company and corporation. Since I've come into this parking lot to sit down out of the rain that's sprinkling, a white vehicle, a actual Chevrolet, sort of like an expedition, pulled into the lot and parked. Since that time, my computer has started to be a little haywire and my activities online have been impeded. But I'm also using free Wi-Fi because it is sort of a standard across retail organizations in America that they offer free Wi-Fi for any person at any time. And you can play it like it's for customers, but how do you know I'm not a customer of the store that I'm working off of? How do you know that I'm not a customer at any time in life? You see, most consumers, if they like a product or if they like a company, if they like a store, are customers for life. But here's what I can say to the little boy or little girl that's playing in my life. You have fucked yourself before God. And if you think God's going to tolerate your life much longer, He is not. And I'm actually channeling for you right now because that's what people of faith do. Every human being who's a Christian, every human being who's a Muslim, every human being who's a black atheist, whatever, can channel. The only question is, what are you channeling? Are you channeling the love and light of the Lord, or are you channeling aspects of Satan that will put you in prison, put you in strife, put you in struggle, and put you in hell in the afterlife? You see, you don't have to believe in God to not end up in hell, and you don't have to believe in God to end up in heaven. But the reality is, you probably won't end up in heaven if your whole life is about abusing someone through technology, confusing someone in their mind, and sexually assaulting them so that you can have a gay old time. Nobody wants your mouth on anybody's anything if they didn't offer you that in permissions, in consent, and in private time. Private conversations are just that. They're private. They're not meant for any law enforcement officer to assess because that officer doesn't know one fucking thing you did in intimate times in a person's house, in a person's office, in a person's kitchen, in a person's bedroom. They don't know. But you know. But maybe you forgot.